This is a video about uh, creating gradient text in Photoshop Elements 10. Uh, we'll start here by creating a new blank file. I'm going to pick uh, 1280 by 720 with a white background. I'm going to start by putting our panel bin in the picture. And I'm going to put some text. I'm going to choose Comic Sans 72 point bold Let's enlarge this a little bit. Now, we're going to uh, add another layer. Before we do that, we're going to go to the Gradient tool. And we're going to edit this. Let's take a look at this starting from the beginning. So uh, this would be, say, a generic uh, black to white gradient. We're going to put another point in here. And we'll start out with this one. Make a uh, orange kind of color here. This one here, I'm going to pick a dark blue. And look over here, something kind of different. So, this is just a random choice for a solid gradient. And uh, so, we'll set that up that way. Now we're going to uh, add a layer and we'll use this for the gradient. And we will, with the gradient tool selected, we're going to look at the mode. And uh, there's a number of choices here. We're going to pick the linear dodge for an interesting effect. And then we click and it sets our. Uh, gradient. I'm going to move this up. And we're going to hold down the alternate key. Click here. And this creates a layer mask that gives us the effect of having the gradient just on the text. Then we're going to uh, some text effects here. And taking the text tool, we're going to click on the text, highlight the whole thing, holding the uh, key down. Now we're going to go to warp your text, choose a bulge. Let's see what kind of effect we're getting here. And uh, we're going to extend that bend a little bit. Do a little bit of uh, horizontal distortion and some vertical. Until we get just what it is that we're looking for. That looks pretty good. Select this again. I'm just going to make this a little bit bigger. And finally, I'm going to go here to my background layer. Now, of course, you can make alterations to the gradient at any time. And for instance, right here, we can go and select that uh, gradient layer. Uh, go back to the uh, gradient tool. And let's say we change this effect from the linear dodge to the um, uh, color dodge. And try that on here. 
and that produces a pretty dramatic effect. So I like that a little bit better, and we'll save it at that. And so that pretty much covers uh, creating gradient text. For further information, go to drinfrastructure.com.